Hey guys, it's Jay. I'm just sitting here fixing the keyboard on my laptop, and I thought that you guys might want to know how to fix, uh, replace keys on your laptops or your notebook keyboard. So I'll show you that. It's a pretty simple process. Thought you all might want to see how to do that. Let's find out. Okay, so this is my salvage keyboard. Uh, working on my Acer Nitro here. So this is the one I'm popping the keys off of. So all you really need to do is get, they, they sell keyboard tools, and I'll actually post a link in my description to a keyboard tool, but I'm just using a pocket knife because that's what I have here. But I just come into here and kind of just pop this side up. Okay, so I'm going to work on this key right here. The only reason I'm using the knife is just to keep the key pushed up. Make sure your computer is turned off for this process. So I'll just put this underneath the key like this. I'm not going to pry it with the knife. I'm going to take my finger right here. I'm just going to kind of pop it up. Clip, clip. And then there's a clip on the other side. Take it. Pop it this way. And now your key is loose. Uh, and to put it back on, it's just reverse. Take the key. Set it in its spot. Take it. Just push it down to here. Click four times. One, two, three. Three. Click. There's the fourth one. It's really quiet. Uh, and then your key's back in. This hardware right here pops out. This is what actually connects right here. You connect your keys to these four little holes here. You actually connect your keys here, which is one here, one here, one here, one here. You can see it. These are actually the things you connect your keys to. It connects here, here, out here, and in out here. And then right here, right here, right here, and right here, connect to your actual keyboard. So sometimes these pop off when you're pulling your key, so be careful. Go ahead and pop that off, and then it just blows the pieces. Sometimes those pop off. Um, just be careful not to to pull too hard. If they pop off, they just latch back in here, 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 and here. It's really about that simple. Oops. There you go. Put the B key in the wrong spot. All right. And before you know it, you'll have a keyboard that used to look like this because I've been putting my old keys back on. This computer, <laughs> and it'll look like this. So I don't quite have all the keys done yet, but you can see what I'm talking about. I've replaced quite a bit of keys here. Uh, so we have a keyboard that's starting to work look nice. Believe it or not, this computer is barely two, not even two years old yet. We use them so much at footsteps. All right. All right, well, I'm Jay. That's my to-do list. Thanks for stopping. All right. A little bit on a thumbnail, so. I do a lot of my thumbnails where I'm just on like this, like, so. I don't know, because, yep. All right. See you later.